and we're back. Then to win, welcome back here at Dobson Ranch. Uh, we have a fun one today. I got one of my really good buddies here and a professional, and we're gonna have some good content. So the first six, we're gonna do three six hold matches. The first six, we're just gonna do Daniel and I. Right. Daniel and I, it's a good buddy of mine. Um, we're gonna just do a best ball match play, um, and then I'll tell you uh, what what uh, episode two and three will be once we get there. But for now, let me introduce the man of the hour, Matt Laringus. So great to meet you. Laringus, laryngitis. Laryngitis. That's what I'm gonna. Yeah, whatever. So. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Give us a. Give us a. a been professional since 2014. Monday qualified for a couple web.com and Corn Ferry events and made it to the US Open sectionals five of the eight years I've done that. Wow. Just working to get higher status on PJ Canada this year. And, uh, Let's go. See Thank what we can do. Man, Love so you guys are in for a treat. Either A, yeah. Daniel and I are gonna get absolutely smashed, yep. or the camera's gonna make him fold. We're gonna figure that out. <laughs> so let's get right to it. You got a tee? You wanna flip the tee? She goes first, yep. either us or them. It's on hey. you, brother. I'm gonna, I'm, gonna do the, I'm gonna do the one yarder. I'm gonna go way back. Laryngeus. Are you, you going all the way back? I go all the way back. Oh, we did guy. this at Sterling Grove the other day. This guy. Where we played the whole course. One step off the back of the box. This man's making up his own tee boxes. <laughs> Yeah, that, don't do it. Don't do it. So that's what differentiates you from us. Those right there. Taking side bets on it, we were saying it's. it's Smell that voice? It's blood in the water. It is. <laughs> that is, dude. That's blood. I was gonna say. I was. Just, I was gonna say inside. Inside four feet. Inside four feet is probably ninety nine percent. It's up there. It's going in. Yeah, it's up there for sure. Like we had expected. Yeah. Down one. Yeah, yeah. After one. <laughs> <laughs> so. I, I thought we could fight a little bit better than that, but at least we made him earn it. Yeah. I need one of those little punch stickers to take off these guys' heads. That's right. <laughs> Oh, 
not a long drive process when we pull, right? Oh, of course it is. <laughs> <laughs> We're in for a treat here. This guy's a baller. Like, typically, I wouldn't be that excited to tie a hole. <laughs> but we're in the tough six. We're trying to survive these yeah. six. Yeah, it's true. Yeah. <laughs> we're, I feel like this is our defensive six. And then we've got, like, special team six, and then our offense is waiting for the third quarter. Yeah. <laughs> Playing the same tees here, boys. Yes, we are. Come on, let's get one back. Just one. Hey, shank it golf 20% used thin to win hooked it up with the uh, with the tiger dry fit hat I don't know but like these kind of moisture wicking dry fit material feel really good they hooked us up with a little ball marker legalized mulligans hey shank it golf 20% used thin to win You hit that tree really good though. Yeah, I, 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 that was, I didn't say what I hit really Solid good. Time. I said I hit it really good. We for sure should play up here. We need, we need the help. Okay. It's a totally different hole from back there versus up here. Daniel has decided to call an audible, and he's going to play up with me. So what do you think your favorite 
moment so far in your gar golf history has been? Ooh, that's a great question. I'd say it's really hard to narrow that down to one or two, but I'd say making it into the first web.com event mm -hmm. that I Monday in for in Nashville. A couple weeks prior, I was doing some skins games locally at like Papago and the Shads game, and the game was just kind of feeling over the map. And just about like two or three days before I flew out, I found something with a swing and shot seven under in the Monday, made it through a seven way playoff for three spots. The last spot I made, I was like, holy shit, I'm actually going to get a start. Right. Like in a PGA sanctioned event, right. web.com. It's like, man, I've been working since I've been eight years old, having wow. this dream and actually teeing it up in an event was. I mean, just a surreal experience, and wow. Was is there a different energy and a different like uh, like angst when you're in an actual professional event versus oh, just a qualifier? Hundred percent. Yeah. I mean, you're there. You show up to the range, and they have your last name on a stall specifically for you with the oh, type wow. of golf ball it's like that a you real have. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's a. That's insane. It's an experience to say the least. That's awesome. It's a great time. I love it. But congrats. Thank you. As a pro. Everybody tune in. As a pro. As a pro. The before it was the Safeway and now it's Century up in Napa. Yeah, yeah. Yep. They yep. used to hold or they still hold the qualifier at Bayonet okay. up in Monterey area. So it's a little bit south of where Napa is. Pre qualifier shoot bogey free four under. Get like T one or T two. Monday, we stick around there for the weekend. Monday, go out there. I lose every ball in my bag except for the last <laughs> ball. I think I had seven balls to start the day with. None of the balls were out of bounds. So the cypress trees that sit on the sides of the fairways just held them. Caught all my balls. So I had a, when I say smooth, smooth 87 <laughs> after you shooting. You can't see it and identify. You gotta play with Why you go back? Yeah. So I did that on one hole, I hit two balls in the same tree, like same spot, couldn't find them. So yeah. Did was, you have a Fitbit on that day? Uh, <laughs> man, that was an track epic the, ride. Track the steps Family, and the heart bay. Parents drove up. Just brother, playing tennis. Just, everybody like the whole <laughs> family's pumped, like, oh he's gonna do the Monday and all that stuff. 87. Complete shit running down the leg. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> oh god. Three putt. 2017. Oh yeah, it happens to everybody. Anyway, golf does not pick and choose. <laughs> Beautiful. Wind's kind of behind us too, right? Wow. Wow. Oh man, that was absolutely pumped. I got a whole. You're up one. there, bro. If you really want. Oh, you're good. No. I like my wooden tees. <laughs> Absolutely pumped. I <laughs> shouldn't hurt you, honestly. From back here. Yeah, it's 320 to that tree through it, so. God, you guys are piping those, dude. Stay right, stay right. Caught the cart path, going down, hand signal down. And then just rotate your body per normal. Interesting. So that gets the club laid off inside, and then your your hands will just naturally learn how to. The club's in. Yeah, that's perfect. Yeah. Thank you. So that's okay. gonna help you naturally, like your hands will start to rotate yeah. over. So then when you get here, and then your, your yep. hands will over time. It's gonna it it everything's a process, but that's that, yes, that's the action. So on this one. Okay. I think six is too much with wind behind me. Yeah, and then even like another shot. Bad chips. Chips would be great. And then say like another play that some guys might do is just hit just a straight, instead of trying to go on the high draw around yeah. it, is then say, okay, so I hit a high draw, what if it doesn't move and I'm in the bunker? Yeah. What if I just punch it straight out the pin, if it doesn't get there, I'm just in grass. Totally. So you're thinking percentages in your head, okay, how many times am I gonna get up and down from hitting a punch that's short of the green in grass? A, high, a higher percentage than in the bunker. Most of the time, now, some guys like bunkers, but there's always that. So you, think, so you think the, you don't think I can get a seven up quick enough? Well, you, uh, over this tree? Yeah. Like under under this front and over this next, 
You don't think I can get a seven up quick enough? You could probably get a seven up there. Yeah. So it's just it's just preference stuff. Ooh, it got through, didn't it? Stay right. I'm okay That's with that. Both worlds. That was a I great shot. I, I think I double hit it. Big bounce. Big old bounce. Come on, ball. Give it to me. <laughs> there we are. He's on. We'll take it. Calling the for the eagle. Oh, nips it, good. Ladies and gentlemen, the touch. At all. Good right there. Pretty fine. There's no chance I'd do that again, boys. <laughs> There's just no chance. See, that's the difference between him and me, is I had four feet down the hill for birdie and I missed it. He had 25 feet for eagle and lift it. So, can you relate? That's Ooh, cart, no? Left. Does that have enough to get to the cart? No. Oh. Yeah. Oh, okay. Should get past that stuff though. Yeah. Be a little opening, hopefully. God, that ball flight's so pretty. I just love that yeah, little measure. My game is a hundred percent me figuring it out. I haven't had a single <laughs> lesson, so I feel like I. Any any hint that I get, I'll use. Trust oh yeah, me. we got you. Exactly. Physiologically, though, if I tee it high, I feel like I'm just gonna hit it like 180 feet dead in the air. What? I don't know. Because you, your driver is the one club that you need to bring lock to it. Like you hit up into it. Where every other one, the club does the lock and hit right. the ball first, and then the ground and the club generates the. The height of the ball flight. Right. The driver is where you put it in the front and you're hitting. You want to hit it on just on the up part of the arc. And so that's what you tee it up higher. You see how high his is? Yeah. Um, I don't go that high, but. I think that's me behind the lock, behind the box. Okay. Oh, it turned on me. It's all right. Just shaking bacon this one. See what we can do. Are you thinking about where you want to miss or where you want to leave it? Like, were you trying to make sure you left it below the hole here? It's around here is a is a must. So if you're in between, you'll go in between to the shorter if you want to be underneath it. That's what I should have done. Come on, roll it, roll it. Man, that died. That's good. Oh, man. Settle, settle. And then it straightens out. Yeah, look at that guy. Yeah, fix this bad boy, yeah. 
Which way do you want me to go? I assume left? Um, yeah, we'll go left. It'll be fine. Can I borrow that too for my marker? Thanks, yes, sir. Big old guy back here. Is that good there? Beautiful. There it is. Son of a bitch. Oh, that was dead in the heart. Oh man, I was walking did like it, that shit was in. Did it push it right over the dude, over the over the thing that you were right. just fixing? <laughs> really? Oh, dude, At man. first I thought dude, I was gonna heart. move it left, so I fixed it, and then the shit bumps it right. <sighs> dude, that oh, was dead man. in the heart, and then it just kicked. Great right. putt, though, man. Thank you. That is sick. <clears throat> And then that goes left. And that goes left. <laughs> that's how it bounces. Just mine. Yeah, that's mine. That puts us at four <laughs> through, through five. Three? Three through five? No, that's four. Shouldn't have watched yours. Oh, we're over here. It messed with me. As as projected, Matt destroyed us. Mop the floor with Yeah, us. that was, I mean, mm. he went four up through six. So uh, that was actually the hardest one. That was the one we were trying to hold our teeth on. Um, so, man, stay tuned next time.